Okay, here we are, another beautiful day down at the 91st Pier in Galveston. Sun's shining. We've got a little bit of cloud cover and some rough surf, but that shouldn't stop us. Um, well, shouldn't stop us from fishing. So we're gonna get our lines out and go ahead and start fishing. Okay, so George actually got a fish. So first fish of the day will be, I think that that's a whiting. I think that might be a southern whiting right there. I mean, it's it's a pretty small fish. He was on a shrimp rig, George. Yeah. Okay. So a little whiting on a shrimp rig. We've had a few bites on the heavy rods. This this rod right here and that rod right there, but otherwise. Otherwise, we've been pretty, it's been pretty calm out here. Not a lot of light. Is it gone? Mine's getting it too. Okay, so we've got two hits, or hopefully two hits, on the bigger rods. Just some line being dragged out, but that's some some action right there. So hopefully we'll get some good bites and maybe get some good fish. Okay, here we go. And Looks like it's, a, it's just a little double up here. Both got some, oh, Dad, Dad's got a croaker. I've got a whiting, so. A little whiting. So there goes that whiting. Yeah. And then here's the croaker. If we, if we can get it unhooked. So those were both. Okay, so here's what the croaker looks like. And what is, oh, goodness. Okay, well that's the croaker. So two, two species. Second species of the day. And that's probably gonna be some live bait. Okay, so George also just caught another Nice little croaker doing basically the same thing Dad did, dropping it. We're going to, yeah. So that's what a croaker is. I think we heard him croak when Dad caught him. But so this guy's not going to croak for a second because he. Oh, okay. So we're just going to kind of gently just let him go and ease back in. So, another little croaker. Hopefully we'll get something bigger soon, but bite is supposed to heat up around 11 on the receding tide. So, I'm gonna aim for that in the hopes of catching a bigger fish. Okay, so we just caught ourselves a, a little shark. This guy somehow got himself The little shark got himself tangled in the line. Okay, so I'm gonna try to get all this. Oh, jeez. Okay. So this little dude, like, must have. Okay. And this might take a second to get off. That's why I want to get bit. So there's that. Hard. Pop Maybe out. you should just unravel it and then get the hook out. I can't unravel it. Okay, maybe I can. Okay, we're gonna try to unravel them here. I think it just died. <laughs> George. 
James. Oh, like the camera died? It was an 88, so it should be hard. Turn it back on, maybe? No, it is on. It's gone. Okay. So, camera on the side there. Okay, oh, geez. Oh, he unraveled himself. No, I unraveled him. Oh. Okay, so my my little bro is okay. I can, okay, okay. Here we go. Here. Oh, jeez. <laughs> well, here he is. Nice little, tiny little shark, but still shark on the big rod. He's going to go back. Well, that was just a, just a little bundle of sharks. Okay. Just caught another, well, I caught another nice little shark. He's again tangled up. So again, I will have to untangle him. Um, this is the second one today for us. Also, it's like about the same size. But other people on the pier have been catching a lot of bonnet heads. And whatever the shark is in the comments, someone, can you please tell us what this baby is and we might put it on the video. But this is just a small little, little dude. Very, very little. So we're gonna get him unhooked and, well, mostly untangled. So, just, just hoping he doesn't try to bite me. The last one was feisty. Come on. Okay. Come on. So, yeah, we don't know what this shark is. Okay, there we go. Just need a little more tingling. Okay. And then, okay, this guy is like very tangled. Okay. So we'll, we'll tell you guys and we get this dude untangled. Okay, so we got him unhooked. This little, like this, this very, very little shark. We, here he is. So again, we have, I don't think we know what this is. So if somebody could help us out in the comments, we also, we might just find it out on our own, but just a nice, nice little dude. Also on the big rod, we caught him on some cut up whiting just a huge chunk of cut up whiting we ate it all so here he goes bye bye so i just got this little hardhead catfish that's a gaff top that is actually a gaff top uh so we're just gonna get him unhooked yeah so gaff top you can tell because of their extremely long here extremely long top fins and whiskers so this guy's a, a tiny little gaff top. They get much bigger. But he is a cool fish, so we're gonna get him unhooked and just chuck him off the side. Okay, Georgia's got a nice shark. Get the pyramid, get the pyramid. Don't go. Cool. See it? No, we're okay, it's probably a shark.
On that pillar. Dang, that was a big shark. That was not even on. That was on a, the shrimp rod. So. Nice fish. Okay. Oh, well, we were getting a bite on another whiting head. George, if George can bring it up. So this is really what we're using. It's just a little whiting head that we're throwing out. We're kept catching them freshly and then just chucking them out they are basically what really gets those bites so we're gonna hope that we get some more and maybe catch a, a fish this time nice bonnet head so different shark species right here he is really nice looking caught on some shrimp on a redfish rig which was amazing he hit it like as soon as it was in the water just a really nice looking fish pretty and just an amazing all right we have this shark on i think it's a bonnet head right into the net. Mm -hmm. You won the slide. Yep. Oh, oh. That was a heck of a fight. That's this pretty relatively small bonnet head game. All right, we're gonna get this, uh, we're gonna get him unhooked and get him back. his release. Yeah. All right. Okay, so here he is. This is like a nice Strips out. And there he goes. got another shark on it looks like it is probably a bonnet head I think so that makes one for each of us today on camera we'll, we're gonna see if we can get him into the pier net there it goes and it's in the pier nets 
George with a bonnet head. That one looks, that's probably the smallest of the day. Tangled, so we'll get back to you and we've untangled him and we're ready to release him So we're just gonna release this guy and Smallest of the day So let's get him back Okay, so today turned out to be a beautiful day for fishing We had an amazing time. We got a lot of sharks today some other smaller fish, some croaker whiting, and other types of bait fish, but all around today was a good day. We lost a couple rigs on sharks, 